well that was a four minute intro um <laughs> i was just updating the uh sub badges because they are a bit out of date so i was updating the sub badge to be more with the up-to-date uh design that it uses but yeah give me a second uh okay um... Okay, so we should be about ready to start there then. Uh, let me just unmute that and then move over to here and this might break. Oh, it didn't break. That's actually impressive because it broke last time. Um, so <laughs> in the last stream that I did, uh, we did a full randomizer run and we beat the game. This time I want to do something a little bit different, and I know I'm not going to be able to beat the game this time, but it might still be fun just to sort of see what happens. Um, is my... My stream is dying a little bit, that's a little bit weird. Um, give me a second and try and fix this. Because uh, I should be able to, at the very least, make this a little bit better. Actually if I do that then close that, that should work. That should help. Okay. So there's a few more extra files. I was messing around with some stuff. Uh, I think all of the runs that I'm gonna do, all the, all the playthroughs that I'm gonna try and do, um, I'll do it on memory card 2 instead. Um, you can see at the top the seed that I'm using which is permadeath. As we go through the stream I'm going to swap out the seed with other seeds. And maybe just do random seeds because it, it really won't matter that much. Um, but yeah, so um, I'll just put in whatever, let's just do the ABC, sure. And then we can get started. Uh, this should have the new game plus stuff enabled because I did beat the game in the last stream so I should be able to skip all the cutscenes and stuff. Um, which means that the opening won't take like seven years like it did in the last stream at the very least. Yeah I can skip everything okay good. This opening is, we're going to see this opening a lot because I'm probably going to die a lot. Okay. Whoops. Okay, that was actually <laughs> surprisingly good. See, in the last stream, I said that I, when I was setting up for that stream, I was able to, um, I was able to do that first try every time without taking any damage. That time I actually did do it first try without taking any damage, so I actually proved that I wasn't lying this time. Because in the last stream, I actually like got hit a lot at the end of the fight and then lost all my health, but. There you go, now you know I'm not lying. I can do that without taking any hits. I don't know if the strategy I used in the last stream was the same, but... I should have been similar enough. Wait, what weapons do we have? Okay, that's not great. This doesn't really matter because we're going to lose all of it anyway. I mean, we started with the Dragon Helm, right? That's actually something you normally start with, I think. Okay, I'm gonna have to just like double swing them to get through this a bit quicker because otherwise this is gonna- oh yeah. This is gonna take ages. Great. Really? Yeah, I'm just gonna wait for it to go forward, okay. 
I'm being terrible. That's fine. Actually, how? Actually, because I can check. How long did it actually take me to? Forty-nine seconds. Not bad. Uh, what's in here then? Is this some? That's not very useful, but I'll take the heart as well because why not? Doesn't really make a difference, but you know, I want it. Oh, now I can kill them in one hit. Okay, so it was literally just like a few points of damage away from killing them in one hit before. And because of the level up, it is actually enough. That is a boomerang, I'm never gonna use that. Okay. Yep, take my stuff. Thank you. Okay, so. I haven't actually tested this seed at all. In the last stream I actually tested it a little bit to make sure it worked. I haven't tested this one at all so I don't know what resists them. That's... okay. Smart potion. Okay. What relic are we getting? Is that still a... Okay. So that actually opens up a lot of possibilities right off the bat. No pun intended. That's just a med- actually what does a medal even do? Defense plus one, attack plus one. Sure. It's- I don't have anything else yet so sure. Um. Actually, I guess I could go do the first boss, that would make sense. And there's another relic in that room, so... Yeah, that would be the thing that would be the most sensible to do. Even though I have that, it would still be most sensible to do things in sort of a cohesive order. And then hopefully I can get some items, maybe. Can't use that. I'm never even gonna use that because I'm not gonna get the fairy probably. And if I do, I'm never gonna equip the fairy, so it'll make a difference. Uh is there anything uh anything else over here? Oh yeah, there's that which is a monster vial. Good. Um Is this just chicken room? Taki room, whatever. That's also useful, but not quite what I wanted. Actually, it's not really useful at all because I already have what you call it. I already have Soul of Bat, so that's literally never going to be useful in this battle. Um, is this Thunder? Okay. I'm not getting anything good here. I'm just gonna hope like at least one enemy drops something that's sl even slightly useful because otherwise this isn't gonna be good. I can do the first boss without... Like max up, okay. I can do the first boss without um, a weapon but... Oh for god's sake. Or I should be able to because I tried it and I was able to do it. I actually don't remember what's up this way. Empty them in. Great. I probably should remember what's up there because I did it like a bunch of times in the last show. But... Uh, Okay, let's go to the save rooms regain health because I don't want to die immediately. Um, it didn't give me an option to not save then, it just instantly saved. Okay. That's fine. I, I, well, I'm not going to let this save anyway if I die, so... I'm trying to think. Over there is... 
a room that I can't get through yet because I need the thingy stun or whatever it is. The thing that opens like sealed doors, I need that. Um, I'm probably going to accidentally jump into him a few times, but that's fine. What a great first boss. Actually, I need to wait here for that. And now I can go up here and get whatever this relic is. Wait. My f my favorite my favorite familiar already. Okay. It's not even good. I just like the way it looks. Like it's it's without well the coolest looking familiar, and that's the only reason I like it. Like he's never gonna hit anything, and if he does, I'll be impressed. But why am I calling it him as a sword? That doesn't make sense. The elevator. I'm not going down that elevator. Yeah, if that elevator wasn't a pen, um, I would absolutely go down it. But it's so slow. I just can't load. Is anyone gonna drop anything? Uh... I should probably spend some time like grinding some of the enemies at some point because otherwise I'm not gonna have any items, but I don't know. Okay. Yeah, I I've I figured out that this is probably like one of the best paths for me to take, just generally speaking, because it has sort of like the highest concentration of relics on it that you can get straight away, especially if you have like something that is in the delay, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to find anything. Anything useful anywhere. Thank you for the $25 skeleton. How useful, I'm totally gonna use that. Actually it depends on what's in the shop. If there's something like useful in the shop then yeah. But I'll go right. Strawberry. Can you stop throwing the buttons? Okay. Well, there's a sword at least. It only does one more damage, but. One damage is better than none, so. Yeah, I'm never going to use that. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. I, I can't jump. Okay. It would be fantastic if I could actually find a few for Zoe at some point. But I definitely want to be able to. Wait, is there something over here or am I misremembering? There is. It's a safe room. Okay. Oh, I can just back out of the menu and it restores my health. Okay, great. Okay, that's that's fine then. Oh. <laughs> Fleeman. God that Like this is this is gonna be the worst part just because Fleeman is so hard to hit. Well, I can at least go short up here, which is a plus, maybe. Depends on what's up here, but... Okay. Sure, we'll go with that. Um, there we go. I messed up the second input. Look potion, shield, rod. Well, there's more damage, so I think I found my weapon. Okay. 
Okay. Yeah, if I can just find the Alucard shield somehow now, then this this is over. Like, this isn't even a challenge, like, if I actually find the, the, the Alucard shield. I don't think I'll be able to, but... I... Can I please hit it? No. Okay. So I still need the thing to open the sealed bars so I can go down to the caves. I still need form of mist. Probably need a of that because there's no way I'm gonna remember the dark room now. And then then what? I think at that point I can just go to the second castle, right? Uh, I think so, yeah. Yeah, I can't think of anything like off the top of my head that, like, I actually uh, that I actually need other than those sort of free relics. That's fine, I don't care. <laughs> I just I, I just wanna get past it, like I don't care if I'm taking damage to do it. It's only one as well actually. Why is it only one damage? Why do I have ten defense? Oh right, because I don't have any items that lower my defense yet. Okay. That's why, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, in that case, I'm really hoping that this is something good. That's not good. Uh, I'm gonna show at least. That's another block. Okay, uh, I mean, I can skip double gun with 10 at least. Hamburger, not what I want. Well, I say I can skip do a doppelganger tent. I can go in from the other direction. See, this isn't something that you're normally supposed to be able to do. I'm pretty sure, anyway, you can't normally do this. Ah, oh, but this is going to be the thing. No, it's not. Wait. Wait, he he can use the bat bomb? I in in the in normal gameplay you can never normally see that, can you? Cause I swear like I swear you normally get the bat long after this part. Like it's one of the last things you get, but I don't know if there's a way to like avoid this fight for the entire game up until you get the bat. Huh. I actually that's actually really surprised me. I didn't really... Okay. I wonder if he can also use the wolf form then as well as like the mist one. I should probably go to the library as well actually, real quick. Cause there's at least one relic I can get there and I can also get the- I'll see what's in the shop as well which would be useful. Oh. Okay they're taking two hits, that's not what I was expecting. Okay, no, they're only taking one. Okay, I'm getting thrown off because some things are dying instantly and other things aren't and I don't know which ones are gonna die instantly. Well, the books aren't. The ectoplasm as well, but the books just won't. Can I get 
any kind of like item drops. I I don't care what it is. I just want an item drop. Oh wow, the sword actually killed something. Huh? Fire of that. That's I'm never gonna use that. Really, Britain. <laughs> Again. There we go. All I want is Alakad Shield at this point. If I can get Alakad Shield, that's it. Uh, that's not where I want to go. Up here, maybe? That is Power Wolf, which I'm never going to use. Uh, there's nothing else in this room, is there? No. Uh, actually, wait, wasn't there something else over there that I missed? Or am I thinking of a different room? I might be thinking of a different room, but I'll go back and check just because I know it was a different room. Wait, let me. No, okay, that's fine. I, I, I keep messing up the second input to extend it. Oh, there was a wall. Good. Okay. Um, actually, let me just... Uh, okay, there's nothing going on there. Okay, there we go. I just realised I didn't have something open, but now I do, so... Uh, okay, fire item. I'm interested in this. Okay. <laughs> Thank you! Uh... What else is there? Camera coin. Holy Rod. Heaven Surge. Yeah, that's okay, I guess, but not great. Wait, the other cat. If I can get 3,000, I can just like, I'm interested in this. buy the Alucard shield. I'm interested in this. But does an enemy drop the Alucard shield? Because if one of them do are the bags, then no. Bones of Azar, you don't. You don't drop anything there. Axe Knight. That's a sub weapon, I'm pretty sure, but I don't know which one it is. Goggles. Longer power of sire, that's not going to be useful. Stone mass, bone weed. Oh, yeah, you want a No. I don't think any of them are going to drop the Alucard shield. Like, you won't because you're a boss. Still in it? Spellbook. No. Ectoplasm. Jeep. Okay. This is done. And that's it. Yeah. Farewell for now. So. I can randomly find the Alucard shield somewhere, or I can get 4,000 and buy an Alucard shield if I can't find one. Honestly, both of those sound like good options, and I don't know which one I'm gonna have to go with. Uh, 176 gold, okay. If I can get one of the Watyun Jigs to drop a duplicator, then 
That will be useful as well, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to get that to happen. Oh, I'm not pressing that, okay. Yeah, I'm not sure if they're actually going to drop it or not. And if they do, I don't know what the drop chance would be, so... That's my money at least. To be honest, I should probably go and kill an axe lord. Yeah, I should probably go kill an axe lord, find out what the sub weapon it drops is, and then if it's the stopwatch, I'll, I, I will go back to the centre of the castle, I will unlock the room that normally has the alicart stuff in it and then uh, I'll see what's in there because there might be something good in there. If there's nothing good in there then I have no clue. Uh, that's really not useful. Like, out of everything that could have been, that's probably one of the least useful things. Oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll go get it anyway because it is a relic and it's still useful, but it's not like, the most useful. I don't really think that, like, that's actually required for anything. To be honest. Um, it might be, maybe, but... If it is required, I can't think of a place where it would be. Like, there are items underwater, but you can get them by just going into the water and taking damage. It's not that big of a deal. Um, okay, I'm not going anywhere. So in that case, um, I'm trying to think then. There's a relic up here, I know that. What it'll be is anyone's guess that is literally useless. Um, right. Okay, that's fine. Uh, do I want to bother with the room in here? Because if I do, it will be a huge pain and it, there might not even be anything good in it. But there could be the yellow card shield. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do it. But if it's not the Alucard shield, I'm going to be annoyed. Okay, that's the first one. Okay, that's the second one. Two, oh, for God's sake. Hey, it's a good thing I got the thing that lets me go in water. <laughs> okay. So, this one... Can I even reach it? No. Okay. And then... And then... There's a good chance I might actually die in this room, to be honest. Actually, probably not. I think I'm doing fine now. I went past it. Uh, okay.
There we go. Okay, what is it? Alcab, mate. I mean, okay, to be, to be fair, that was actually a pretty good. A pretty good investment. Restores HP by ice damage. There's like only a few enemies in the game that do ice damage, right? So that's not going to be very useful, but. Uh, increases intelligence as well, so. Yeah. Uh, actually, I should probably equip something else. I'll keep the stone sword equipped as well because that actually swings quicker, I'm pretty sure. I think slightly quicker, yeah. Whether or not it's actually effective, who knows, but... Ah, uh, it's effective enough. There we go. Can I just get up here, please? Actually, do I want to go in this room? Because there's loads of flea men in here. And flea men are the absolute worst. Okay. Uh, okay. That's good. That's not good because he's got, got all his health back. Okay. Do you actually drop anything? No. The credit sword is actually pretty good, isn't it? 76, that's pretty good. It swings slowly, I think, but... Doesn't it have an effect as well? No, I, no, it just... It just swings slowly and does loads of damage. Okay. That is, yeah, that's really slow. That actually might be too slow. Yeah, if I want to attack with this, I'm going to have to jump to use it because otherwise it's way too slow to swing on the floor. Like with that, I can actually attack with it, but yeah, that's going to be really awkward. Okay. There's something in this room, isn't there, but I don't remember where it is. Oh, that was stupid. I know for a fact there's like an item in one of the walls in this room, but I don't know where. Is it on the top somewhere? So like here. No, I have no clue. Or is that only in the inverted castle actually? I don't know. Um Oh, there's something here. Ah, oh, but come on. Okay. And there's nothing. Okay. I know, is it this I'm thinking of? It's their second. That's a full heal, isn't it? I'm pretty sure the elixir is a, like a full health reset. Um. What a difficult boss. So this takes me to, yeah, the throne room, pretty much. If I could please, there we go. Nope, please stop. Please stop. <laughs> I thought that would hurt. I thought that would also hurt. Could you 
probably sub. We're only taking one damage, but could you please sub? That's the sword, that is the Merman statue. Okay. I think it seems like I'm getting like everything that actually um, is useful for progression at the minute. I know. Please stop. <laughs> okay. And that's the leap stone, yeah. That's not really as useful because I already have that, but... Yeah, it'll... that's fine. I'll take it. Actually, seeing as I can go straight up to the throne room, I should probably... Uh, open the ceiling. And then... Get the stuff up here. Okay. That's not very useful, but... I got some, like, sellable rings at least, I think, right? Yeah. You have bananas and that's it. But there's something up here as well, isn't there? Yeah. Uh, Morning side. That's a heart refresh. I probably won't use it, but I'll take it. And okay, so now I have infinite <laughs> infinite vertical mobility. Okay, right. That's actually incredibly useful, so I'm not gonna complain. Don't need to go in there. This is the teleporter room, isn't it? So if I go through here and no, this isn't the teleporter room. Where's the teleporter room gone? Oh, it's below, isn't it? Yeah, it's down here. Guess I'll keep. Okay. So that can take me back to the start of the game. Uh, is there anything else? over here that I could actually use. By then, never gonna use that. Did I go into this room earlier? I don't remember. I did, yeah. I didn't go into this room, but... I didn't need to, so... I'm not gonna complain. Um, I thought, what if the what zombies actually drop this time round? I actually kinda wanna know. Oh, okay. Nothing apparently. They will drop something, it's just I can't get it to spawn. That's a shame. Wait, did I never open the rock? And I just open the other side and then never that side again. Up here is what? It's the two difficult guys, isn't it? And then a save room and that's it. Well, they were difficult like in my first playthrough. But... Okay. Please let me move. Okay. Okay. That is the save room and then this one is the room with something in it. 
And it's with Lost Song. That is... I'm never gonna use that. Good, thanks. Okay. Um, Okay. Uh, seeing as I'm here, I might as well take a look uh, at the the exterior as well. It's not like the actual like anywhere. Because there is a relic there that I might need. But... Yeah, attacking normally is not an option for that guy because he's going to get back up too quickly. He isn't going to drop anything now. Why am I batting when I can do this? Skill of Okay, I'm never going to use that one. Uh, okay then, that is a bunch of stuff I'm never going to use once. I want to... Can I please... Can, please? Let me do it. <laughs> I, can't, I can't get it to work. There we go. I think that's the first, like, helmet thing I've got, isn't it? Oh no. I got that as well. But it doesn't really do anything different, so what's the point? If it did something like significantly different, then sure. Like the wizard hat is pretty good. But I don't think I'm gonna find another wizard hat anytime soon. Okay. I don't know. The man man actually drops stuff, don't they? But I've never actually seen something drop from them yet, I don't think. Maybe they do drop something and I'm just getting unlucky, but... How much money do I have? A thousand hundred, okay. To be fair, I should probably go back to the library, actually. Um, yeah, I should probably go back to the library because... Uh, I might have enough from those two rings that I found to be able to buy the Alucard shield, and if I can, then... Um, the game is basically over at that point. It's just going to be Alucard Shield all the way to the end of the game. Uh, did I find... where is it? Oh no, wait, I didn't actually activate the teleport on the library, did I? Okay. Okay, in that case, I'm gonna take a long way back around to the library just so that I can get some of this stuff as well. Why am I doing this? Is that how it's okay. I have gravity boots. I keep forgetting I have gravity boots. Okay. Um. You are not dropping anything. Are you going to drop some? Oh, well, there's nobody here, is there? I thought. I swear there's at least one enemy here. Oh no, it's the red ghosts. Okay. Actually, what did I even drop? See, 
seeing as I spawn infinitely, like, I might as well say. They might not actually. I mean, they will drop something, it's just like they spawn right and it's going really well. It seems like most of the spawn rates for like um, uh, items that I drop by enemies are like, really low. Well. I'm not. I'm honestly, I'm not even sure if they are dropping anything actually. Now that I look at it, I feel like I would have had at least one drop by now if they were. Yeah, this isn't going anywhere. These guys tend to drop some pretty fun stuff though. Where was that? Okay, I, I lied. They, they don't drop anything fun. All they drop is pen and that's it. At this point, I'm starting to think I'm not going to die here. So. Like, if something does go wrong that causes me to die, I have no idea what it would be. Like, the setup for this gun is just too perfect for me to die in it. Which is ironic, because the seed is permadeath, so... You would have expected it to be harder. <laughs> obviously, the get obviously the, the generator doesn't like realize that I typed in permadeath and then make it harder. But I would have expected a permadeath seed to be harder than anything else. But no, it's just giving me everything that I need to be it. Okay. You know what? Let's go do all Rox's quarters real quick. Why not? Like, there's no reason not to, so... And I don't think I'm, I'm gonna die to all rocks, so... I should be fine on that front. What do I have in here? Um, magic missile and the gamma. Okay. So I can almost definitely make enough money to buy the Alucard shield from the library if I just sell the stuff that I've got. If I don't do that, then I can probably still get enough money just by killing stuff, to be honest. Oh yeah, there's nothing in there. Um, isn't there something down here? Actually, I don't know what's down here. Colosseum, right. I'm gonna ignore the Colosseum for now, because I might not need the, to go to the Colosseum. And hopefully I don't need to go to the Colosseum, but knowing my luck I probably will. Yeah, um... 
This is a teleporter, isn't it? Yeah, I should activate this so that I can always come back here. Because otherwise I'm going to have the same problem I had with the outer wall. And not being able to come back to the outer wall is going to be a huge pain. I'm really hoping like I just run into an item that's an alucard shield or something. That's sushi. Can I... There we go. That looks up. On. Okay, well I definitely have enough to sell now at least. Uh, again. Okay. That's it. There should be an item here. Not really what I wanted, but it'll do. This is a save room, isn't it? Yeah. Should restart my health there so that I don't die. And I think there's a relic over here, right? No, but there is an item. That I'm never gonna use as well. Okay, good. Can I please? I keep messing up the inputs for the wing smash. Oh well. Okay, there's a relic in this hallway that we sound about. Is it like up here? No, it's here, isn't it? Dual weapon, that's actually something I need as well. So I have that. I don't have form on this yet, no. Um, so if I can get form of mist as well, then I can finish the first castle at this point. So whether or not I'm going to have all the items that I need to finish the first castle, probably not, but... Oh, to finish the second castle, rather, there might still be some, like, things that I need to find in here first, but... I have the eye of that at least, right? Yeah, and the rib. So I've got two of them. Um... I've already found like quite a lot of them. Uh, I need to go further along, don't I? Because the entrance is there. And then. <laughs> Keep messing it up. Oh, wait, there's life. To oh, bleh, okay, life up down there. Did I ever find a cap? No. No, I didn't. Okay. That's fine. I'll just kill all rocks and see what happens. Assuming I don't die to all rocks. I probably won't die to all rocks. Okay, well that's the first one. Okay. Oh, it's, it's only doing one damage, yeah, I should be fine. That's fine. I, I'm taking one damage, so it doesn't matter. Okay. Okay. 
mate. Pff, there we go. And I don't remember what's over here. A relic. Okay. Great. Not even what I'm going to use. At least I know there's like no like part seventy for the second castle over here at least. I still, uh, I still need farm with mist as well, so I do need to get that at some point. Um, hold on. I'm trying to think where I might have missed a relic, if I've missed any so far. I guess I can go back and do the labyrinth, right? I'm oh, not the labyrinth, Colosseum. I keep calling it a labyrinth for some reason. Yeah, I'll go back and do the Colosseum. So why was that? It was just straight to the left. Okay. Right, I mean, so back dash then, that was a mistake. Okay. It's fine. I I didn't mess up anything too badly, so it's, it's okay. Uh okay. So, I'm trying to remember why you need to go in the Colosseum. I don't need to be in here then. I'm pretty sure there's only one relic in the Colosseum, right? And it's that one. So if that isn't the relic that I need, that other, isn't a relic that I need, then I don't need to do any of the Colosseum. If I'm wrong, someone please tell me because I don't know if there are actually any other relics in the Colosseum other than that one. Um, assuming that's the only one, then... Hold on. Assuming that's the only one, then... What I should probably do is... First of all, I should go find uh, an axe lord and keep killing an axe lord until it drops its sub weapon. And if it's the stopwatch, then I have a means of getting even more items. If it isn't the stopwatch, I'm a little bit screwed. <laughs> Not really, I just can't go into the other room. Um, Or maybe I should just go straight for the library. Actually, I have the thingy so I can unlock. I can unlock the cabin, uh, the caves now, right? And I have the thing that makes the ferryman appear in the sort of like other cave. So that's another relic I have access to. Yeah, I think there's like two relics in the caves that I can get right now. Uh, okay. I'm gonna hold off on buying the Alakad shield for now. Um, because I might still find it somewhere. I don't know where I'd find it, but I might still find it. If I don't find it once I'm done with the caves, uh, then I will come back up and buy it. I know the entrance isn't here, it's just there might be something down here. That pentagon's pretty good. If I could get my hands on one of those duplicates, then that's also an alternative way to beat the game. Uh, well, what 
let's just try. Yeah, so I'm gonna go through the caves. I'll get everything down here. Then I'm pretty sure there's a teleporter at the start of the mine, right? So if I get the teleporter at the start of the mine, then uh, I can go back up to the throne room area. And once I'm there, I can uh, go straight across to the outer wall, go back into the library, buy an Alcard shield, and then that'll be it for the rest of the game. There's lots of items over here actually, isn't there? Yeah, because there's this one and then there's like loads more of them. So there's a chance I might actually just find the old card shield here, but I probably won't. Uh, that's okay, that's walk armor. Sure, I'll take that. Diamond. Well, now I can definitely afford the alcohol shield. And the Holy Sword. I need to do this anyway, so I might as well do it now. Actually, would the Holy Sword do extra damage against the Succubus? Hold on, let me just have a look at how much damage it does. That's 54, but... Oh no, wait, I can't see damage values. If the Succubus is weak to the Holy Sword, then that means I can kill it in a few less hits. Okay. I don't know if it is or not. Okay. You know, let's take a look at how long it's taken so far. Not even an hour in. <laughs> um... That is, like, really quick though, how far I've been going through this. Um, okay. I thought this seed was like gonna be horrible, but it's it's really not. Come on. And then the ferryman should be down here. Oh yeah, this is the only place where the healed by ice thing is gonna be actually a thing. Do I still have that equipped? Resource HP by ice damage. Oh, is that if I do ice damage? Uh, okay, never mind. Please don't speak. <laughs> Your voice is awful. Okay. Like, the ferryman has the worst voice actor. Uh, hey, Rebel Esco. Uh, that... Isn't a thing I need? Is that a monster vial? Uh, okay. Hear the news about Twitch. What news about Twitch? There's like a lot of stuff that happens on Twitch. I don't know what. Like, if there's a specific thing that would have happened. Um. There we go. That is actually something I needed. Wow, okay. That's actually really impressive that the game actually gave me something. Good. Uh, take that as 
Uh, yeah, what, what news? Because there's a lot of news and I'm not sure like if I've heard it or not. I might as well take this as well, though, I don't know. That was one spot one, okay. Luminous? That's actually an okay sword as well, I think. But I'm not gonna have a reason to use that. So I can't, and then I'm gonna make myself. Push experiment into a similar system. Similar to mixed system where viewers get points for watching that they can spend on their streamer. I should be looking down into cash. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't hear about that. That's pretty neat, actually, that they'd be doing that. Um, Cause, what are you talking about? A stream Labs already has something sort of similar to that in like the loyalty system, but it's not great. It's still in there. Okay. Um, and obviously with the Streamlabs loyalty system, like, it doesn't turn into actual money, so yeah. But that is actually kind of cool that they're trying that. I, I hope they roll that out to like everyone at some point, because that'll be really neat. Um, okay. This will focus. That isn't something I need. Good. Uh, yeah, that that does sound really, really cool. But, um, I'm not sure like what. Turn on the streamer. Just... Hold on. Your points for watching they can spend on the streamer. The streamer can spend cash. Is it just? I'm guessing like there's a reward system as well, like where you can spend stuff on specific rewards, or is it just you give money to streamer by watching streamer? Um... Wait, that's a shield. Okay. Oh fuck. Oh, uh, that was the first sword that I had in one of the other places. I'm never going to forget the tower that was my first weapon in a randomizer playthrough. Um, okay. I'm trying to think, is there anything else? I still need the parts of blood at least. I, I walked straight into that. I, I don't know why, but yeah. Uh, you can find your points on any stream with my understanding. Like, is there, like, is there like a thing for it though? Like, I, I, like the thing is, I'm confused. Like, it, is it just like a thing where you watch streams and then you get points and then you can spend them on any stream at all? Oh, and then it just turns into money for that streamer, or is it like... Um, so that's it, there's no, there's no like actual like rewards or anything for, it, for the viewers. It's just the points themselves are the rewards for watching and then you can spend it on anyone. I don't know why I keep going back out of this room, because I need to stay in the room. Actually, I need to turn this off, because it's going to kill the thing that I need to keep alive. Right. Okay. That sort of makes sense if that's what it is, but... I still would kind of prefer that to have sort of like a, a reward system as well, though, so you could actually like give things to people spend them. I'm going to have to look this up, because like I'm... I'll, I'll be honest, like it's, it's, 
I, I know, I know, yeah, I know what you're saying, and it makes sense. It's just I want to know like if there's any more to it than just that or not, because that doesn't sound very fleshed out. If that's all it is. Um, Like, I, I, I would want there to be some sort of reward for it, isn't it? Yeah, but... Being in beta for Twitch basically just means they'll fix any bugs related to it and... They're testing it to make sure it works in general. Like, they don't really tend to add more features to it while something's in beta from what I can tell. Maybe they do, maybe they've done that in the past, but from what I remember they've never really done that. I don't know, I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll look more into it later because it, it does sound interesting. I just want to sort of get a bit more of a better idea of how that would work when it's actually implemented. Do, do, hold on, do I have the demon card? No. No, I don't. Okay. Right, so I think there's a teleporter on the right side and then I can go back up and get some stuff. Although, I want to get this first because... Actually, I don't need that. Yeah, that's gas cloud, I don't need that. Um... Just walking into everything. Uh, I think this is a teleporter. It better be a teleporter, otherwise I'm going to be annoyed. Okay, that is good. So in that case, I still need to go on the left side because there's still a relic on that side and then I can take the teleport back after that. But first of all, first of all, I need to go all the way back to the, what you call it as well. Uh, to the outer wall so I can buy the alicard shield. And I still have the demon card, so I can't get in there. That's a shame. Oops. Okay. That was a surprisingly complex set of, like, inputs to actually do that exact thing, but... And to be fair, I could probably look it up now actually because I'm kind of curious how that works, but I also don't want to just stop the stream temporarily for it. Morning set, not what I wanted. Blunders, also not what I wanted. Oops. I have power in this one, right? Yeah. Uh, there should be an item here, right? Wait, there's no item here. Oh, there it is. Okay, I don't need that. And that is another stone sword. It's something I will also never use again. Good. I'm getting so many items that I'm never gonna use. It's really annoying. Okay. Wait, that, that didn't hit me. How did that not hit me? I'll take you to a place. Oh god, please skip it. <laughs> I don't want to listen to him. Can I just... Can I please do the input correctly? That would be good. 
I can't, I can't do it. There we go. And that's soul wolf, something else I'm never going to use. Good. Okay. That's fine, I guess. It's just a little bit annoying. And there's nothing down here. Really? I keep failing to do the second set of inputs as well, which is really annoying. Uh, that is the Uckle. Great. Don't need that. I already have enough money from the rings anyway, so I can just sell them all. And that is... is that red red? Yeah, it is. Okay. So I don't want to use them that either. Finding loads of stuff that I just have no reason to use. Wait, I didn't open it. Okay, that's what it is. Right, I get you. And there was nothing good in there. Of course there isn't. <laughs> Why would there ever be anything good anywhere? I can't. Can I actually do the inputs correctly? But for once that would be nice. Please? Please? Okay, good. Jesus Christ, playing this game is like playing a fighting game. It's fine. Uh, okay. So I need to go... Where do I need to go? Okay, I need to go to the... what do you call it? So the top of the castle and then I can just teleport, uh, not teleport, I can just go all the way back through to, not here, uh, to the library and then I can go all the way back down again. Uh, hi Robbie Smith. Uh, right. So which way is that? It's all the way over there. Okay. As long as I don't mess anything up with this, I really don't think I'm gonna die again. Oh, again, I haven't died once so far, but I don't think I'm gonna die, like, as long as I don't mess up anything on the way there. And then once I've got the Alcat shield, I should be good for the rest of the game. That should be about them. And then from there it's just go back through the towers. Actually I should check what's in the sort of like courtyard area first because I went nowhere. Um because the thing I'm looking for might be the other guy shield might actually be there. And I didn't check that before. Uh, if your sister or a cat, what name would you have? I'm, like... <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> if my sister were a cat, what name would she have? Um, I couldn't tell you, I'll be totally honest. Wait, the duplicate is here. The, the, the duplicate. The duplicate is here. Okay. Um, well that completely broke again. game. 
if you're a cat, what, like, that's the thing though, like, do you mean what name would she have, would she pick for herself? What name would I pick? Any suggestions for a name? I mean, I, I don't know, I feel as though Ploppy is probably fine for a name for it, if she was a cat. Like, I don't know. Like, Floppykins is already, like, stupid enough for an name for a cat, so... It's a really stupid name, but it, it definitely works as an name. Wait, oh, it's in the deuce there. Oh wait, I never got that before. Okay. Um... Yeah, I, I, I honestly can't think of any name. Pressing too much of me. I'm trying to, like, focus on, like, seven different things at once. Uh, <laughs> I can I can't come up with names. Uh, right. There was no fog here before. Why is there fog? Here? Uh, where am I? Okay. Uh, that's good then because... Uh, actually, wait, I should see what item drops from underneath the library as well. It probably won't be anything useful, but... Yeah, infinite bat pentagrams is really dumb. It was a life up, good. Is it just one item? Yeah, it's just one item. Like, the bat pentagram does, I think it's 99 damage to every enemy on screen, so every time I do this, that's 99 damage to everything. I think it's 99. It does 113 because I actually have a higher attack than that. Yeah, that's even dumber. Actually, coming back here was a good idea because I needed to go through the get that the mist was stealing as well. I didn't even realise that was a thing I needed to look for, but no, that is. Okay. What can I do for you? I'm interested in this. So <laughs> that and then I this. should just be able to buy. Alcat shield, there it is. Uh, while I'm at it, let's also buy the castle map and... Thank you. Uh... Ink of Life? No, I don't really need that. Yeah, I feel like that should be enough for now. Uh, Dwarven Necklace. Plus fifteen. Okay. Actually, while I'm here, I'll sell all the rings what actually, just do so that you? I don't have them in my mind. I'm interested already. in this. So now the game can be well and truly broken. Um. Alucard shield and shield rod. 
and we are now invincible. Good. Permanently. Until I die. Which will not happen. Uh, have I gone this way? No. Oh yeah, because I left it until I got so, uh, from the mist, didn't I? So... Yeah, my shield is now my best weapon, so... That was a boss. It was a boss, but now it's dead. Wait, the music didn't even go away. We're still in boss music. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. And that's echo of that. This music is not going away. I think I killed the boss too quickly. <laughs> I am actually like really surprised that this is a thing that's happened. And it's gone. I was hoping I'd get like some horrible luck and I'd get a horrible seed where I wouldn't get anything useful at all and then I'd die and have no defence, but... No, the game has decided that I'm gonna get everything I need to survive. Okay. That's another duplicate. I don't need it, but that is another duplicate. It doesn't even matter, like, how much damage I do. Like, my attack value doesn't matter anymore. Wait, do I have a mana prism? I don't have a mana prism. Okay. I was gonna say, because if I had a mana prism, I could duplicate it and then... Uh, basically use the shield infinitely. I can basically use it infinitely anyway, but... It's not quite infinite. Almost infinite. Okay, that guy is actually causing problems, but he's the only one. There's the teleporter, and all the way back down into the moon. That should be the one there, this should be that one, Oryx's Quarters. The next one should be... Uh -huh. And this one should be the mine. Yeah, I don't really need to like pick up any items anymore. If it's armor, I will because armor is still useful, but if it isn't armor then I don't 
really have a use for it. Like, I have the objectively best weapon in the game. Um... There isn't a secret though. Okay. Uh, so yeah, I think this is the dark. Yeah, this is the dark one. Isn't it like this, and then like this, and then? Yeah, I have the thing to actually see in it. I just want to see if I could remember the layout. Okay, and that should be not light because I didn't summon it for long enough. Okay. Well, what's up? I'll still take car max ups because why not? But... Blood clock. Converse damage to hearts. But that lowers my luck by one, so. I'm good, thanks. I'm just not gonna do that one. There's the spike barker armor. And I now can basically finish the first castle. But there's still some relics that I haven't found yet, so. I think. There's six relics in the second castle. So hold on, how many have I found so far? One, two, well how many haven't I found? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I know the one that I'm missing because it's in the Colosseum. So yeah, if we don't count the one in the Colosseum, which I don't need because it's just one of the cards, then I've got every single thing in this first castle so I can just leave without ever even doing the Colosseum, okay. I should equip the spike breaker armor before I do that. Uh, right. I have a look actually, what have I got equipped? Death plus one, tag plus one. I might replace that with the lapis lazuli if I can go back to the library and buy it. I should be able to, but if I can't, then I just won't. Okay. Uh, this is the correct way to go. Okay. So I think. The thing I'm probably going to be using then is that for the extra defense and then the lapis lazuli for... I don't really need luck for anything. No, I should probably use something that increases defense actually. What am I doing? That is defense plus one, but... I don't know if like there are any other accessories that increase defense by like a significant amount. There might be, but I just might not remember them.
Uh, where is this going to take me? Eh, uh, whatever. Actually, no way. I'm not sure which way would be quicker. I feel as though actually going through the sort of the keep area would probably be quicker actually because then it's just a straight path to the to the spike hallway. Yeah, that'll make more sense. Well, this is fun just going over here. This is actually the first time I've entered this area, isn't it? Yeah, I've never actually entered this area yet. Again, though, I haven't needed to so far, anyway. Oh, boss fighting. I'll take the life up as well. So it's always nice having health. Impressive. <laughs> Skipping the cutscene there was probably a stupid thing to do, but that was a pretty good cutscene. I liked it. Uh, again, so shut it down. And then straight across down there. And there it is. Is this ghost gonna play out the same way? Did you find Richter? No, I didn't. I don't know if he's the one you're looking for, but I found a Belmont. No, I didn't. Really? So he is here? But the one I saw was the enemy. He was the lord of this castle. I, I, I never met Richter because I never went to the Colosseum. I have no idea what you're talking about, Alucard. No, I don't do this. I like making sure everything's broken again. Uh, so gold ring, silver ring, and then alakar mail, and that should be it. Uh, I have walk armor, but it's not very good because I don't have many places that I found. Um I'm trying to think. I'll keep that equipped for now because I don't like an extra plus from defense is good, but um... I'll just go for all Rox's quarters to get them. I've got to like stick to having discovered as little of the castle as possible I can. I don't want to explore like much of the castle. Like I want, I want to explore as little of it as I can, while still finishing the game. <laughs> Why am I doing it this way when I have gravity boots? What am I doing?
really? Okay. Okay, so if I just go all the way back down, I'll be straight into the clock tower, clock room, whatever. And then I can just finish the first castle from there, I guess. Like, I don't... I don't think I have anything else to do in this castle at that point. I've got all the relics except for the one in the Colosseum, but I know what the one in the Colosseum is, so it doesn't matter. Oh, I forgot to put the silver ring on. I was confused as to why that wasn't working then, but yeah, I forgot the silver ring. That explains it. Uh, there's something over here, right? Other than the server room, I meant over here. Completely useless, that's what it is. Oh, I was hoping I could jump into it. Yep, come on, give me the holy glasses, fine. Thank you. Just turn into a bat and do that, yeah. I should have done that in the first place. I don't know why I didn't do that in the first place, but... I should have done that in the first place. Why did I do that? I still have the thing. Um... Actually, I should go back up into Allrox's claws. Yeah, if I go back into Allrox's claws, um, whoops. Uh, I can use the teleport up there to go to the top of the castle and then I can finish this part. As long as I don't accidentally kill Richter. Should I? S uh, okay, I'm, I'm gonna save in case I accidentally kill Richter because that's not technically a. That's not technically me dying, right? That's just me screwing up and ending the game in the incorrect way. That shouldn't be classed as a death if I kill Rixxer instead, right? Especially after how well this run has gone so far. I'm not, I'm not going to accept killing Rixxer as a reason to restart. Anyone says that if I kill Rixxer I have to restart, I am banning you from my chat. I'm not actually, but I, I can threaten you with banning you from my chat. Okay. Okay. Holy glasses. 
And then let's not kill Richter, please. Okay, I should turn off the sword because that's going to kill Richter as well. This is so awkward. Did I do it? Magnificent. But now feel No, I've accidentally triggered the second form. No. I did it. Okay. <laughs> okay, I didn't kill Richter. I didn't die to the second form of Richter. We're doing good. That was like the one scary part where I could have accidentally messed up, but I didn't mess up, so everything's fine. Uh, okay. Okay, I think at this point I just want as much defense as possible more than anything else. Um... Anyway, that has more defense. Okay. Yeah, as long as I can have, like, as much defense as humanly possible, then I should be good. Really? Hand my soap, wipe my soap, that's good. Parasire, that's garbage, but whatever. Parasire is really not that good. While I'm here, I'll go and see if there's anything good over here as well. That's a diamond. Then, is this ice? No. Eh, that mess up. I mean, I haven't found any sub weapons, but. Eh. This is a save room, isn't it? Yeah, I don't want to be here. Those are grips. I literally do not care. <laughs> okay, I can't go up there. Right, in that case, I have to... Go this way. Yeah, I have to go this way. Is there anything actually over here? Uh... Because I'm still like, armor would still be useful. I have 50 defense already, but... Additional armor would also be nice. Okay, there's a thing. There is nothing here. Good. Oh, hello. That's a big skull. I didn't realize, like, this skull was here. Uh, right, okay. So I need to just, like, do all the bosses in this area then, because... Uh, three of them will be parts of Vlad, the other two will be... Um, I think one of them is going to be a card and the other one will be Kubazori. I... did I get them where? No. 
This is a boss, right? I think there's a boss right here. No. I went the wrong way. Okay, I've cast it no more. I know there's a boss over here, at least. Oops. Wet and curse. Oh god. Okay. Oh wait, I need to turn the sword back on. What level is that? 15. Okay. How long has it taken me so far? 1 hour 34 to save Rick to Belmont. This has actually been a really quick playthrough. Getting cursed every single time I do that is so annoying. At least I don't have to go through there again. I don't know what I do. Oh yeah. Really? How is this Black Panther doing? Why can't I kill it? What is happening? Why is my shield do- Do I have to react to that? Oh, does getting cursed take away the shield effect? Okay. Hello Medusa. Goodbye Medusa. Uh, hello True Blue 299. Uh, that is Heart of Blood. That's the one that avoids curse for- oh thank god, okay. Right, I should probably go back and do the other boss that I missed as well. And then... I didn't mean to do the cloud, but whatever the cloud works. Um, yeah, if I do the boss that I missed, hopefully that's another part that I need, and then it's just one relic left. And who knows if the relic that I need is on the complete other side of the castle, or if it's going to be the next boss that I fight. So this is going to be either really annoying or actually not that bad. I'm expecting it to be on the annoying side though. Because there are, what, six relics in this castle? Okay, please be one of the parts of Vlad. Please be one of the parts of Vlad. Okay. Okay, right. So that means the card that I left in the first castle was whichever one I'm missing. It was the demon one. So the demon card is the one left in the first castle. And then... Hey, lovely. One, two, three, four... Where? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, never mind. So the six that I'm missing. There's one left in the first castle, so that's five that I'm missing. I just got one there, I just got that one. There are six in this castle, so six minus two is four. Four plus one is five. Okay. Wait, did I say there were five missing? One, two, three, four, five, six. Did I miss one in the first castle? Okay, I'm hoping the one I missed wasn't one that's important, because if it is then I'm gonna have to go back to the first castle and look through the whole thing again. Oh, whoops. 
Yeah, that's gonna be annoying if that's the case. I don't even remember where the bosses are in this castle, so... If the... Uh, well, not much. Uh, if the bosses aren't in places that I can easily get to, then I have no clue what I'm doing. Oh no. Oh no. Oh fuck. I'm, I, yeah, I'm not gonna die at this point, I'm pretty sure. Like, I should be fine for the rest of the game, it's just... Actually finishing the game is gonna be a huge nightmare. To be fair, th this playthrough has gone way quicker than the last one though. I didn't have to spend like three hours just looking for a single relic. Because I found it straight away. I might have to spend three hours looking for a different relic instead. That's gonna be fun. So, so, hold on, someone tell me how many relics are in this castle, because it's six, right, I think. I'm 99% sure there's six, because there are the five pieces of lad and then uh, Force of Echo, which I already found Force of Echo in the first castle, so that's not here. Um... Uh, come on. I don't know. This is really annoying. Ah, please stop. Okay. Because I think I've messed up my counting and there might actually be a relic that I missed in the first castle. Let me just check again. So, counting the ones that I just picked up. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. That's seven. So, hold on. One, two, two missing there. I picked up that one. That's three. I picked up that one. That's four, five, six, seven. I, I miscounted. I miscounted. Okay, never mind. There's one more in the first castle I missed. Okay, that's gonna be a huge burn if it's the last one that I need. Because, well, is it in the Colosseum? I know it's not in the Colosseum. I've been in the Colosseum. I saw what I saw the relic in the Colosseum. I know it's not there. I I hope. It can't be in the Colosseum. <laughs> There's only one relic in the Colosseum, right? Actually, I'm, I, I need to check. Hold on, where's the relic tracker? I need to take off the ones that I've definitely got. Okay. Relic... Where? Relic tracker. Item tracker. Is that what I'm looking for? Okay. Reset the tracker. So... I have, like, all of these. I have that, I have that, I have that, I have that. So all of the castles should be accessible. I definitely got that one. 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 I left the one in the Colosseum which is Fallen Mist. I got that one. I definitely got that one. Definitely got that one. Definitely got that one. Did I get that one? I think I did. Um, I definitely got both of those. Did I ever go there? I must have done. There's no relic at the bottom of the castle, so it isn't there. Well, I've got that one, I've got that one at least. So, yeah, there's a boss there that I was thinking about. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Where?
Wait, am I miscounting again? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What's that one? It doesn't say because it's off the screen. Hold on. Oh, gas cloud is in this castle. So there's seven in this castle, so no, it actually adds up then. Okay, never mind, it's fine. I did it. <laughs> I got all of them. It's fine. I haven't I haven't messed anything up. Uh I need to send that back over to the game again. There we go. Yeah, I, for a moment that I thought I'd like mess something up, but no I haven't. I did miscount the amount of relics that I had remaining, but I also miscounted the amount of relics that I had to get, get in this castle, so it, it adds up. It's fine. I'm being thrown all over the place. Really? Out of mana in this room. Is this the one I'm thinking of? Or is this the reverse library? Is this the. This is the reverse library. Okay. I, I literally don't need to come here. This whole area is meaningless for the purposes of this. And then it should be over here? Yeah, okay. So this is where the boss should be. Easy. Give me one of the pieces of lead that I need. Don't give me something that I don't need. That is completely fine. What can never shouting for whatever the hell she's shouting for? Okay, well at least I can get things from candles now, so that's actually not meaningless. Wow, look, we're getting stuff from candles. Crazy. I went in a circle. Good. Yeah, that's really disappointing that I got keepers early. It shouldn't be disappointing because I can get stuff from candles now. It should be a great like, oh wow, I can actually get items, but no, it's, it's not. Meal ticket. You know what we can do with this? Hold on. Where is it? We can just spawn infinite food from this. This is great. There are multiple pieces on the floor. Did I get a weapon out of that? No, it's food. Okay. Uh, right, uh, I should probably re-equip the shield rod because it's more important than that is. I have two duplicates, oh yeah. It's useless, but I have two of them. Battle air. Is this where I need to go? I think this one's where I need to go. 
Yeah, yeah, it is. It's incredible that I can finally get stuff from candles and it's just hearts, that's it. Nothing else. I am very disappointed. I'm more disappointed that I just ran into that knowing full well that it was there. Oh wow, I actually got some weapons? Wait, when did that happen? I'm actually really surprised that I actually got some weapons. It feels like an eternity ago that I last got some weapon. I mean, I didn't have a sub weapon in this entire playthrough at least, so there's the axe. Wow. Crazy. Might as well actually use it, seeing as I have one now. I'm still waiting for the circles though. That isn't the set watch, but it's still pretty new. Well, that went badly, but... Yeah, getting hit by that sword is awful. Um... Do I have to go into our Roxas quarters again? Is there something in Aurora's quarters or am I misremembering? There's a life max up, great. There's a magic missile, great. There's an unchaku, great. Oh, uh, wait, what? Wait. Why is it not letting me? Okay. I was gonna say that seemed a little bit weird, but I got it working. It's actually a really powerful sub weapon, what the hell? Okay. Okay, that was almost a little bit scary. Spikes always do one eighth of your max health, I think, so. That skeleton jumped into the wall. Where did he go? Diamond. Hey, you were a boss in the first castle and now you're dead. That's a harsh demotion. Demoted from boss to enemy. Hide. Good.
Is this another boss fight? I would hope it would be, yeah. Oh. Okay, I just... That one enough. Uh, blur, you feel poop. Why do you feel poop? What's happened? What's, what's happened? I fall and I can't get up. Of course. Spirit Orb. Uh, right, that's something that I definitely don't need. Um, shows enemy damage. Wow. Great. Still need these two. Uh, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get them anytime soon. I need to go to the Coliseum, actually. Fairly quiet stream and just tired. Ah, oh, fair enough. I mean, you're saying that, but you realise that, for the most part, most of the people also tend to have fairly quiet streams most of the time. Wait, is it one off again? There we go. Wait, I'm only doing 245 damage. Like, that's not right. I should be doing more than 245. Ah, uh, go away, please. Okay, that was actually... Okay. I'm surprised that they just jumped straight into that, but... Actually, I should... Did I look in these before? No, I didn't. Neutron bomb. And then... What's in here? How am I up? What's in here? Suck on. Can I... Um... Please? Okay. Where is the entrance to the Colosseum again? I do not remember. I want to say it's at the top right, but I don't know if that's right or not. Why am I still collecting money? It's, it doesn't even do anything. Money is like meaningless. Okay, here's the Colosseum. Oh, it wore off again. Please go away. have anything that increases my magic or to regenerate magic rather no no I don't think I do elixir doesn't that's for source HP No, I don't. And that's annoying. Uh, if I go through here, that should take me pretty much straight to the boss, right? Yeah, this should be the boss. I need to regenerate my shield though, that's the thing. Okay, I'm gonna have to use a different weapon. Uh... 
I don't know what I can use. Wait, where's the... Oh, I know, I know exactly what I can use. Hold on, where is it? Bat pentagram. Please all die, thank you. How much health do these guys have? Holy crap. It's like a thousand health each. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Okay. Oh, Again. Please be a relic. It's not a relic. The relic. The, no relic spawns here. Why didn't I realise that? I need to increase my max mana a bit because it's way too low at the minute. Is it dead? Nope. Did that just? Oh, no, I think I did too much damage. I don't really need to kill this, but I want to. Where'd it go? Oh, okay, it's just gone. Uh, right, so there's a boss somewhere over here, I'm pretty sure. No, I've already fell on. I'm attacking now. How many relics have I found in this castle so far? I don't remember. I want to say like three. I want to say three. Three relics sounds correct, but I have no clue. Which means that I still have four bosses left, if that's the case. Okay. I didn't want to do that, of course, that happened. <laughs> why can't I... I have no mana, that's why. Yeah, and that's why. This should take me close to another boss at least. Hopefully it does. I would hope this would take me right next to another boss. Yeah it does. Okay, good. I should do that and then wait around for a minute. Wait, there'll be a save room actually that can restore my mana. Go in there and. Ah. Okay. And I don't have to redo the shield rod either, so that's actually really good. Oh, it's this boss. Who is now dead. So... That also didn't have a relic. Good. Where are the relics in this castle?
I actually don't know where the relics are. I'm so glad there's a no, what you call it here. Uh, oh, for this is so annoying. Yeah, I can't kill- yeah, if those guys hit me I just can't do anything. Really? Could you please die? Thank you. Uh-oh. Was that an iron thing? Thanks. Thanks again. Uh, I can't jump. The hell? Oh, they're making me attack. Okay. Um. Well, that's really annoying. I hope that doesn't happen again. Don't hit me. Oh, for There's still more. Those are possibly the most annoying enemies in the game. I don't care what anyone says, those are now officially my most hated enemy in this game. Because of that single room. Like with the Fleemen, you can just go past them. With those guys, you have to go through them, no matter what. Okay. So now I should be back at the entrance ish. Yeah. Wait, I was gonna say, he didn't hit me. Sure, I'll take that as well. So, I need to go into the underground caves then? Please stop. Please stop. This is painful. Where? Where am I going? Oh, this way. I'm trying to like figure out like exactly what I need to do here. I'm pretty sure I need to go. That's the stopwatch. Wow, I actually got it. I actually got the stopwatch before the game ended. I am impressed. Um. I don't want it. I don't want that at this point. Like that's way too late to get me it. Uh, I have no clue where I'm going anymore because I don't remember the layout and I can't picture it in reverse. Oh no, I think I know where I am. If I'm correct, then... No, I have no clue. 
Oh no, wait. No, I do, no, I do. Because this is the room where normally, yeah, you fall down and then you have to go back up the stairs on the other side. So the, the entrance should be close then. Where? Where's the entrance to the caves? Oh, it's over there, I see it. Right. Actually, you know what? Seeing as I can do it, let's let's go see what's what's in here. Garnet and Gladius. TNT and a banana. That's it. Wonderful. Perfect. I'm sure in the first castle it would have been like the same exact thing, just absolute garbage. Done though. Like, as long as I can get to the underground, I'm pretty sure. Um, like, I'm pretty sure the last things that I need should just be down there. I can't think of like any other places where they would be if there are any other places that they would be. Charl Hill. Oh, whoops. There we go. Um. I wonder what they did with the. what do you call it, room? The room where they put the um I'd actually remember what they did with the like what you call it, the succubus room in the inverted castle. So I'm gonna go have a look at it. And I'll open all these while I'm at it, because why not? Okay, how max up? It was over here. It's just empty. Okay. Got them cephalopods. Who do they think they are? Being all cephalopody up in my um, my castle. I managed to do that while messing it up. I am very proud of myself. Uh, okay. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. I'm not sure if there's anything over here that I need. This is a boss room. Oh no, I guess you do see the bat form in this version of the fight. Okay, yeah, it makes sense. Okay. Please be a relic. Uh, I have so many questions. Where are the relics? I need the relics. Like the relics are the most important thing that I need and I just cannot find them. What the fuck is this room? Okay. 
Okay. I do not remember this room existing in the game. They respawn infinitely. Okay, that's weird. Oh, why is it wrong for them? This is probably the most terrifying room I've seen in this game so far. It's just a room of squids. Like, why does this exist? And they infinitely respawn as well. It's not just a room of squids, it's a room of infinitely respawning squids. Like... Why? Why is that there? That's in the- that, like, the enemies don't get randomised, that's just in the actual game, but why? Oh, this is awkward. I have to use the shield rod for it. Okay. Thank god I have the thing that makes me able to die more. This area would be so much worse. If I didn't have that. Is there even anything over here that I need? I don't even know like if there's any oh. Okay. Never mind, the walls are some long. So that one will be the demon card, that one will be something that- I oh the thing that shows enemy names and then that one will be the final piece of lead that I need. The demon card is in the first castle because I left it because I saw it in the Colosseum and I was like nope I'm not getting that. Um, the thing that shows enemy names is somewhere in this castle and the final piece of blood is also somewhere in this castle. Good. I've narrowed it down. To be fair though, like this has gone pretty quick. Like if I actually look, 2 hours 11 minutes. We're currently 2 hours and 30 minutes into the stream. Like. I'm gonna beat Symphony of, the, Symphony of the Night in less than three hours at this rate. Where the entrance to the, uh, the caves are? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Are there two bosses down here, or is it just one? Oh, there's a boss. Oh, hey, Seth. You normally have one of the pieces of lead. So. And death is dead. That was actually really quick. Oh no, he's got the slow second one. Okay. That's the final piece I need. Good. I can just beat the game now. Actually, where? I never found the teleporter in. That's annoying. Okay, it would be easier for me to go 
all the way around to go back then because I don't have a teleporter, back, I don't have teleporter access. This is going to take a little bit, but... That should be all of the relics I need. Heart, tooth, rib, eye, black ring, yep. Okay. I don't need to see enemy names anyway. So then if I go here, death 250, so that's 2 minutes 16 basically. I mean yeah, this where I'm just gonna end up beating the game in probably under two and a half hours actually. Ticket and that's something I need. Nope, didn't want to go that way. I have to go this way because that connects around to here and then I can just fall back down. And then that takes me fairly close to the central room. I just need to go around in a bit of a circle and then I'll be back there. Now I need to go further down. Okay. bit further down and there it is. Um, going the wrong way. <laughs> Good. I didn't realise I was going the wrong way. This is some like really slick movement, apart from when I got hit then, but this is some really slick movement. Oh, I changed up the stopwatch at some point. Okay. And that is the final area open. I did say, like, as soon as I get the Alucard shield, the game is over. Just for fun, I actually want to um, save the game here so that when I beat the game I can see like what my rough percentage was, because I think it's going to be something really low. Well. Okay. So this is the only time I've saved the game apart from like the first time I saved the game because when you first use one of these it forces you to save. So that's the first actual save that I've made in this program, it's just to see what my percentage is at the end. If I die now I won't reload the save and I'll just, that's permadeath obviously so I won't but I also won't die because I have the Alucard shield. Like, unless something goes horribly wrong, I'm not going to die here. You have done well in making it this far. Yes. Now, please enter your orb so that I can finish this fight. Okay, there's that. Time for the final fight against Dracula, and we are done. Just because, actually, does the fight instantly start? Yeah, I'm gonna just do that just to make sure it doesn't like wear off. And we are done. Go back whence you came. 
trouble the soul of my mother no more. I, I can't believe. How? On my first attempt. That was such a great seed. It started off kind of like a little bit rough, but it picked up really quickly. Like starting with form of bat is just such a huge thing to start with. So you made it. I can't skip I'm this one. No. I'm glad you're all right. I'm sorry. It is my fault you had to fight your own father. Yeah, that was not. that was kind I of had ridiculous. My own for destroying him. It must have been Alucard shield you. available for purchase in the Indeed. shop. But you as well, which was incredible. That the only thing necessary for the stream is dropping frames. Nice. For good men to do nothing. Dropping frames I right understand. after finishing oh the game. What will you do now? The blood that flows in my veins is cursed. It would be best for this world if I were to disappear forever. I see. Farewell then. We'll not meet again. Just casually dropped 400 oh friends. Don't you want to go after him, Maria? No, it's best this way. I can't ease his torment. Someday, perhaps, we will meet again. And on that day, maybe. This stream was I literally see. half the length let's of my go. first attempt. Everyone's waiting for us. And I didn't die once. Yes, let's get out of here. Which I did a lot in my first, like, attempt of a randomizer run, play through, whatever. And then we get this incredible credit song. It's a wonderful work of art. Oh, it's so good. Let me just, let me just turn this up. Just turn it more, screw it. I find it ridiculous that that playthrough lasted that long. That really, like, didn't last anywhere nearly as long as I expected it to. Uh, I need to uh, lower that a bit more. Oh, I've got to say, it's 12, there we go. Like... That was definitely under two and a half hours. Uh, can I skip this? No. We have to listen to this. We have no choice. We have to listen to this masterpiece of, of a song. Okay. I mean, I can't blame him. It's a great song. Really fits Castlevania. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do like another run or not because I'm worried that if I try another one it's just gonna be the same thing and it's just gonna be another two hours of this. Another two hours of the game handing itself to me with absolutely no challenge at all.
so ridiculous. I, I, I'm honestly like so surprised by this. Like, two hours ago I started this expecting me to die and not beat the game. First seed I tried. First seed. I didn't even come close to dying. I had so much defense throughout like the first half that by the time I got to the second, by the time I got the Alucard shield, I had no risk of dying and I had so much health by the end. That was a much better seed than the one I started with, like last last stream, which took six and a half hours. That is so ridiculous. I want this to end now because I, I want to see like what my final like percentage of the castles were because I I definitely didn't explore like everything in both castles. I only explored bits and pieces. I did like none of the Colosseum in the original castle because I didn't have to do the Colosseum. Like there was no reason for me to do it. It's actually really, really convenient that you can see the relic in the Colosseum by just going forward. That's actually really useful. I have to keep that in mind because it means that I, I don't have to go through the Colosseum if I can just see that it's something I don't need, like one of the cards. Um, right, what was my final percentage? Um, it was on the second memory card, wasn't it? Yeah, it was that one. 117. That's more than in my original playthrough when it took... In terms of game time, an hour less. In terms of real time, four hours less. That's insane. Like, the difference in seed changed everything. I was able to explore more of the game while exploring less of the game than I had to. Or than I needed to. Or than I could have, rather. Only exploring what I needed to. And I still beat it in less time. How does that even happen? Well, I, I mean, I guess we're done, right? Like, I ended at a higher level as well, level 45 instead of 35. And with way more money, even though, like, I didn't even, like, go to the shop that much. Like, I only sold my rings once in my entire playthrough and then never again. I never went back. I'm so surprised by like how much that seed changed the game. That's, ins that's actually insane. I'm going off the stream there anyway because... I mean, what else is there for me to do? I, I did the permadeath. I did it without dying the first try. What else is left? Like, there, there isn't anything left. There's nothing left. We're done. That was Symphony of the Night Randomized. Permadeath. In less than three hours. Two and a half hours. Actually, hold on. What did it say? It said like two hours and... Actually, I've forgotten what time it said. It was less than two and a half hours though, right? I'm going to quickly just reopen the game. I don't think it's going to be captured because Retroarch finds it really difficult to be captured properly. 
it's um, it's this probably isn't going to show up, but if you were watching the stream a second ago, you will have seen the time anywhere. Uh, and I'll just say it when I see it, but yeah, like that was definitely less than two and a half hours, I think. Real time, it was about two hours and fifty minutes, but. That is just so surprising to me. Hold on. 2019 minutes. If you factor in the time it took me to beat Dracula and actually finish the game, it was probably about 2 hours 20 minutes. So... Yeah, that happened. Um... Jesus, okay. Well, we're done. That's it. The stream's over. There's nothing else for me to do. I will be streaming again tomorrow. I don't know what it'll be. It won't be more of this, unless I decide I want to do even more of this, which I might do, actually. But... Yeah, that was actually a lot of fun, considering... Like, that was way more enjoyable than the first stream I did, because in the first one, I spent three hours looking for... Uh, form of mist and then I found it in a place where I didn't realise it was it would have spawned um but that's how much fun everything should I wear anyway I'm gonna I'm, yeah, I'm gonna end off there anyway so I'll be back again tomorrow like I said um thank you for watching and I don't know what I'm gonna be streaming tomorrow you'll see when I start streaming because I'll start streaming it goodbye